Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question. Okay, so this question belongs to Gate CSE 2014 set to two guys. The question is a consider two strings. Okay, so they gave the string A as a Q, P, Q, R, R. Similarly, string B as a P, Q, P, R, Q, R, P. Okay, so let X be the length of the first string. So the length of the first string is 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. The length of the string B is, uh, I think they did not give. So X will be the length of the, okay, so X is the length of the longest common subsequent. Okay, not necessarily continuous. Okay, so between A and B, let Y be the number of such common subsequents. Okay, so X is the length and Y is the number of those items. Okay, so I think without even using the longest subsequent concept, we can try, right? Yes. So let us try. So here we are having Q, here we are having Q, here we are having P, here we are having P. Okay, but Q is there, Q is there and 1R is there. Okay, so I think I got one pattern here that is nothing but Q, P, Q, R. So this is one pattern which I found. Okay, similarly, let us try to find some other patterns. So one more pattern is there. That is a P Q R R which matches here. So P Q R R which matches here. So P Q R R or it might be in this way right? P Q R R it is here P Q R R. Yes. And I think there is one more sequence that is a okay Q P Q R. So basically this is also there right. So, okay. So Q P Q R we have already taken. Okay. So one more sequence will be okay. Okay, yes, so this is also there. Okay. Okay, so this is also there, right? So QP, so you start from QP, RR, so this is also there. So if you observe Q, P, R, R, similarly Q, P, R, R, got it? Yes. So in total, we are having the three subsequences, guys. Okay, and each of their length is a four. So even if you try more, even after trying for some time, I found only these three subsequences and the length of them is 4. So what is the value of 3? Sorry, what is the value of x? So it is a length. So the length is a 4 and the value of y is a 3 because we are having 3. So the result is a 34. Got it? Yes. So the answer will be 34. It's a quite simple question. But the only thing is, it is always easy for you to solve these kind of questions directly, guys. If you are trying to write the whole subsequent and if you try to solve it using dynamic programming, it will take lots of time. Okay? Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea with respect to this question. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.